is up guys let's go fishing back with another video so today I'm gonna be doing a catch and cook with some porgies if you don't know what they are I'll show you them right now so as you saw those are porgies and um yesterday we went fishing for some porgies we went on a charter boat um we went for like four or five hours and what we use as bait were sandworms. Um, they have little, they have like little pincers, and um, you put them on the hook, you cast them out, you feel a bite, like you're using a jig for bass. So, and then you just feel a bite, and then you just set the hook. You don't want to set it too hard or rip out of the mouth. Same, something like a bluegill or a bass. But it was such a fun time, and when we went fishing for those, we caught a ton of fish. So I'll be showing you some recipes on how to cook them right now. So first, what we're going to be doing is we're just going to be, um, we have our um, filet right here. We're gonna, I'm going to do multiple ones. So this is like um, a small porgy filet. And then we have, I have um, eggs just, and you could scramble them up. Then you're gonna get um, your um, porgy fillet and put it in there. And then you're just gonna wanna move it around um, so it's all covered in eggs and scrambled eggs. Okay, so then from here, you can do whatever you want. I'm just gonna bring it with the fork. Um, here. So once you have it all like, Eggy, we're gonna bring it over here to this uh, seasoning thing. We're gonna put in the seasoning. Uh, it's just basically like um, this right here, I don't know, breadcrumb seasoning. Then from there we're gonna be getting, we're just gonna be um, putting breadcrumbs on it, on the seasoning, and there's I think there's a little bit of flour. So once we have it all seasoned up, we're gonna be putting it on, um, right over here on the frying pan. Um, once you do that, you're just gonna leave it sit till you think it's ready. And then you're just gonna keep doing that till all your um, fillets are done. And um, that's really all how it is for the frying. Um, so there's my um, fillet, so we'll get, so um, there's already porgies on there, so when they're done, we'll put this on and we'll cook it up and then we'll taste it later. So it should be um, um, pretty fun to taste, see how um, these taste. I've had them before, um, I've had them before, so it's just, um, I know how they taste, but just I'm going to tell you how they taste and stuff. Um, they're not too oily, but we'll just um, see when they're done. So I'll keep doing these, and we'll check back in when the frying pan is done. So I'm just finishing up the rest of these. Um, for, um, um, they're all um, in eggs. Um, I have some right here. We're gonna be putting them on the pan soon when those, when that batch is done. But um, I think we have three more ways to cook them. So definitely stay tuned for those. And some of the recipes are gonna get really good. So definitely wanna stay tuned for okay, those. Okay, so we have um, our um, thing. So we're just gonna be putting them in the pan. Um, and, and what's in the pan is just some oil. Some of these pieces are really big. But, and that's really it how this recipe goes. So, um, and we'll wait till these are cooked. And for the next recipe, we're gonna be putting it on the grill outside. So, and then, so first you wanna spray it with um, some Pam so that um, the fish doesn't stick to um, the tin foil. So you wanna get tin foil, and then you're gonna spray it with Pam. So we're gonna be doing, well, it's technically the same recipe, just different stuff that we're gonna add to it to taste different, but um, hopefully these come out good. So uh, my dad is chuck, um, cutting it so like there's no bad meat on it or um, bones. So while um, we're waiting for that, um, we just sprayed it and we'll, Get to the next. This is our first recipe right here. Um, it is um, pe red pepper, zucchini, eggplant, spinach. Um, there's some pepper, salt, um, oil, and uh, it is sauteed with um, garlic stuff. And yeah, we'll be putting this on the first one. And all of these, all of these um, are here are going to be having some garlic, a little bit of garlic on it. So, um, so we'll put this on right here. The stuff in right here and what is that this seafood magic, seafood magic. 
um, adding it on right here. And yeah, all of um, the fish things has seafood magic to that for these two. Um, we're also going to be using some Old Bay seasoning. Um, this one right here. And that one right there. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different recipes that we're going to be trying. Some of them may be um, um, the same. Like this one right here is the same thing as this, just has some tomato sauce on it. Um, and all of them have Old Bay seasoning on them too. So right here, these are done. They have like that stuff on the top, but these have some basil um, and some like garlic stuff, the, the, the right here, the mace, the garlic. Um, this one, and then now we're adding a teeny bit of dill to it um, to give it more flavoring. And now we're gonna be adding butter, just like a teeny bit of butter to um, the top of it to give it more, um, a little bit more oil. Um, so at the end, I'll be telling you my favorite one um, out of all of these. Um, and also the fried ones are over there. They're right, these are gonna be going all right here, gonna be going on the grill outside. And um, yeah, we're gonna, and then um, they're gonna have some um, onion right there, lemon. or lemon, yep, lemon's going on. I honestly have never had any of these before. Like this one's a new one, I'm pretty sure this one's a new one, and this one, I don't know, I think I've had it, I don't know. But, um, this, so that's all, um, the, the stuff that we're gonna be using to cook these. So let's get them on Okay, the so we are outside. First, we're gonna be putting on the ba the basil one, then um, like the sauce, then we're putting on another sauce one, like this bush. And then all it is is just wrapped in um, tin foil. Some more sauce. Um, this is like the one that has barely anything on it right there. And then this one has um, sauce. So we'll see when those are done. And then we'll be tasting them to see which one is going to be the best. And I have no clue what exact temperature um, it needs to be, but just like once in a while, come check, open it, see how um, they look. But these should be done in about 10, 10 minutes or so. So while we are waiting for the fish right here um, to, um, get cooked. Um, I'm gonna be. I want to show you this quick picture of the fish that we caught. I was with my sis, um, both of my sisters. So here's a quick picture of that right now. So we obviously had a great time fishing. So I'm gonna be leaving the um the like the boat name in the description, the company, the phone number, and everything. So go check it out if you're somewhere in the air area. Definitely go check it out. Um, we caught a lot of fish. They do um. They do like eight hour trips, like from six to like three. Then they do from like, um, I don't know, like whenever they get back, they go back out again for night fish, straight bass, bluefish, like we went on, on the last video where um, my friend, we, me and my friends went um, fishing on the boat. Same thing, same exact thing. So I'll be linking them in the description. So definitely guys go check them out. And they're doing like a quick, th they're doing like this thing where they only go out like four hours. And in four hours, we caught a ton of fish. So it was just a so great So definitely go check them out. It'll be linked in the description. And go follow their Instagram too. They also post all... Um, a ton of pictures of just like um, uh, what they caught. Um, they've been doing really good on bluefish. So if you guys want to go out, um, definitely go um, with them because they catch a ton of fish. So yeah, let's. Well, we're still waiting for that, and we'll check back in when that um, when the fish are. Okay, done. guys. So the uh, fish are ready. Here they are. There's some juice coming out of them. Um, so yeah, how they look? Look pretty good. So I have one of everything on my plate. That's the fried, that is like the zucchini, pepper. Um, that is the plain one, that's basil with garlic, and that's the one with tomato sauce. So I'll try all of them, tell you my favorite one, and then you can try to recreate the recipe and make it yourself. <laughs> Okay.
Okay, so I'm done eating, and I finally picked out my favorite one. So my favorite one is the the porgy. Then there's garlic sauce on, like the garlic stuff on top. Then um, basil, and then some dill, and then that um, sea magic, like the seasoning. Um, so that's my favorite. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and let's go fishing out.